All right, today we're going to take a look at a couple of little Christmas presents that I received. And the first two are a couple of cowbells. Kind of small, but pretty cool. And the next one is this. It is an Olight i3T by EOS, or it's the EOS Olight. These have been out for quite a while. And what I like about it, it's got two settings. One is uh, 5 lumens and the other was 180 lumens, which is kind of amazing. That's the 5 lumens. That's the 180. But what I'm interested in is how long the battery lasts because I've been using this um, Streamlight Micro Stream for years. I've had several of these. It's got a good pocket clip just like this one. And they both cost about the same thing. But I am interested in how long the battery lasts. That is the the Olight EOS i3T. And the instructions with this come in. It looks like all these languages, about 15 different languages. So it looks like it's uh, got a worldwide popularity. And the next thing is this Brinks padlock. Uh, it's a solid, solid body padlock and it resists 2400 pounds of cutting to the shackle, two and a half inch shackle I think. It's cut resistant, it's water weather resistant and it is number 161. It's high security. It's got that nice brass body and there's the other uh, 1400 pounds of prying resistance and it's got four pins and it's pick resistant and it was made looks like it was made in China and packaged in the USA so let's see if an amateur like me can pick this thing First we'll put in some put in some to hold the core. And then I'm gonna put the stopwatch on myself. We're on the stopwatch. I'm just gonna use this little pick here. It's got four pins. Okay, and it is open, and that took 22.87 seconds of high resistance. So that's pretty good for an amateur like me, 22 seconds. And let's try out those new cowbells. Eh, not much cowbell sound. Let's try both of them. That's a little better. Let's try some real cowbell. Knuckle bomb. <laughs> 